What's up guys? We're going to do some training in Home Depot. Going to show you the heel work that we've been doing with Gunner. Uh, he's at a point now where he can pretty much off leash heel in really distracted and busy environments like this. So going to show you what that looks like. Uh, and then we'll do a little bit of day in the life video after that. Show you what we're feeding these guys uh, and go from there. So um, first gear check really quick. Uh, he has the Dogtra 282 e-collar on. I'm going to show you what uh, we've been using, how we've been using that. Uh, in a positive, uh, constructive way. Uh, and then of course, we're using Back 40 Dogs Beef Bites as treats. Uh, these are super great, 100% real meat, uh, and they don't get messy in your pocket and they break into smaller pieces super easy. So uh, let's do it. So he is about three weeks into this. I sit down and they both went down. Um, and he's doing really, really good. We practice this outside of an environment like this. That's why I'm comfortable having him off leash, even though I still have control over him with this. So the concept of why we're using this, and I'll go over this over on our website where we have training videos and stuff, but basically uh, it's, it's a pressure and release. So when he, he has already associated that when he feels this pressure, uh, that means he's supposed to get into position by my side. We practice that, uh, and then basically the pressure releases as soon as he is by my side. If he tries to deviate, the pressure goes back on. When he gets back into position, the pressure goes off, and he gets a reward with his favorite treat. So uh, that's basically the, the gist of it in a nutshell. So I was filming Cowboy's butt. It's really important when you're doing heel work too that you practice having them stay um, so that they learn the difference of, oh, I'm not just supposed to stay here the whole time, I'm actually doing a certain action. And then they learn um, to kind of differentiate a little bit better when they're like, oh, stay here, oh, heel here, um, I'm free, you can say, okay. Okay, so Cowboy doesn't have an e-collar on, he's at a completely different level of training than Gunner. Should he still have one on? Probably. Um, but his heel is also not as, I guess, crisp and tightened up as I've been practicing with Gunner simply because he's always near me anyways. Um, so he's kind of just more so in a circle around me in a shadow. That's kind of his heel. Um, but we'll see what he does here. So how about heel?
Bisa. You want two or three? <laughs> what are you guys doing? We're <laughs> training. Oh, nice. How are you doing, buddy? <laughs> are you training? Are you being a good boy? You're being a good boy. Excellent. Good to hear you, mister. So we just recently got more chickens uh, and the dogs are obsessed with them. We haven't had chickens in a while. Uh, this is for Gunner's first time seeing chickens and he is hooked. Cowboy, be quiet. This is Dolly. <laughs> Dolly is a Plymouth Rock. What do you think, Gun? I grew up with chickens. I think they're great. Farm fresh eggs don't compare to store-bought eggs. Eggs are nature's multivitamin. I just huck one on the dog's food. I'll, I'll break it in half on their food so they don't pick it up uh, and like drop it somewhere else that it's not supposed to be. But um, nothing better than a farm fresh egg. Uh, I'm gonna put her down. She's probably sick of me. Good girl. We're trying to get them friendly. They're still uh, pretty young. They're not laying yet. So, um, chicken. That's what I said. <laughs> also, a huge shout out to everyone who shopped our Green Lipped Muscles launch. We just sold out on our website. There are still some available over on Amazon. Um, so thank you seriously guys from the bottom of our hearts. It means so much to us every time you guys support us uh, and you buy any of our products or you follow our stuff, you like, share, subscribe, whatever it is. Um, we really, really appreciate it. Uh, we, don't feed, we wouldn't release a product that we don't feed to our own dogs all the time and the muscles are absolutely great for hip and joint. So check them out. Look how much hairier he is than him. This is Ruger. He is a hairy golden. Look at the uh, look at the fluff. Look at the fluff, man. Jeez, this dog's on his back more than upright. Gunner's coat is so much shorter. All right, we just dropped you guys' orders off at the post office. So stick around and uh, we'll go feed these dogs dinner and we'll show you what we're feeding them. Um, Cowboy got a bath with our new shampoo yesterday, so he's looking pretty good. All right, so we're making the boys dinner. These are our green-lipped mussels that I was talking about earlier. I usually put one of these or one or two of these on there, usually two for Gunner, one for Cowboy and Bo, just because they're smaller. 100% um, New Zealand green-lipped mussels. Uh, they're just a little protein pack, super nutrient dense. Uh, and apparently people are loving them because they sold out on our site. Um, so hopefully by the time you're seeing this, our restock has already showed up, but if not, there are some available over on Amazon still. So head over there and grab a bag if you haven't yet. And then I am also been putting this, I was debating showing you guys this or not. This is going to be our brand new bone broth powder with added probiotics. Um, this will be releasing very, very soon, probably next week to our top dog list. Uh, if you aren't on our top dog list, shoot me an email and we can chat about getting you on there. Basically, it is a group of customers who really believe in our brand and our mission, and those people get first dibs on our products. So um, top dogs will be hearing about this uh, next week, most likely. And this has been absolutely amazing. I'm super, super proud of this product and excited to show this to you guys. Um, so I'll show you the, I'm almost out of this one. Let's see, bear with me. That's what it looks like. And you just put a scoop on there and it is uh, 
packed with glucosamine. It's got the probiotics, MSM, chondroitin, and it's great, great, great for picky eaters. So I usually put the powder on and then I'll just put some water over the top of it um, to hydrate. And then of course, uh, they also get some wild Alaskan fish oil. This is one of the fan favorites. We recently added a pump to the top and we're also going to be coming out with a 32 ounce version um, next week as well. So uh, this month is a big month for us. Um, so if you guys re requested bigger sizes, this is the 16 ounce. So the next size will be double this size. Um, so they get a few pumps of that. Uh, and then they don't get it on their dinner because I gave it to them on their breakfast, but this is our kelp supplement, removes plaque and tartar buildup on their teeth. Um, promotes immunity through their gut health. It has digestive enzymes. Uh, and 75% of your dog's immune system is actually in their gut. So um, this boosts their gut health, helps with immunity, combating allergies, paw licking, ear scratching, yeasty ears, stuff like that. So they get that on their breakfast. Um, and they also get our pumpkin powder on their breakfast. So I mix it up what I give them for breakfast or dinner, but that's the overall high level view of it. Okay. All right, so that about does it for today's video. Uh, as the dogs are eating in the background, that's a great noise. We'll try and edit that out. Um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, and as always, thank you for supporting our company over at backfreedogs.com or at Amazon. Um, and yeah, we're, our mission is just to fuel your guys' dogs for more memories together. So, um, natural superfoods to promote longevity and quality of life. Uh, cowboy, you have any final words? Are you going to do some face rubes? Ah, oh, you just flicked drool on me. Yeah, we got some face rubies. Does it every time. Gunner will do it too. He taught Gunner how to do it. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you next time.